Andy, I sense a, a deep frustration on your part after all of that. Yeah, deep frustration. I mean, look at you know a, a couple of emotions really. Very proud of, of the way the lads performed, but ultimately, uh, yeah, I, I'm frustrated. I'm frustrated. You lost by just a point. Uh, you were still going strong there, deep into stoppage time. There were a lot of hold-ups. Could there have been an extra few seconds played? Do you reckon? Well, I mean, you know, <laughs> there seems to be one rule for one team, uh, you know, for the bigger teams and, and a different rule for the smaller teams. I mean, Dublin get an extra two minutes last night to get to get an equalising score. We don't get two seconds when, when you know, a player is blatantly, at least one player is blatantly lying on the ground for 30 seconds, holding his head because of a, a head injury. But uh, we, get to, we get to two seconds over and the final whistle goes, so maybe you could understand my frustration. It's not as if you didn't have a lot of chances. I, I, that's another part of the frustration. Yes, we did have chances, and we didn't uh, we didn't take some of the good chances that we had, and that you know we can't hide from that fact. But you did play some decent football when you got going well. Yeah, look, at, I, I mean, we asked for uh, I asked for a special effort for the guys today, and I, I, I couldn't complain on, on that front. I think everybody put in a, a really good shift on on very difficult day. In the end, I guess it will stand to them playing championship later on, having been in Division One. I'd like to think so, yeah. I'd, I'd like to think so. As I said, we've 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 had to throw a number of uh, relatively newcomers into the into the scene, and they will have learned an awful lot from that. So, hopefully, when when uh, we have everybody back fighting fit, it will it will make for a stronger panel. In the end, your 70th minute goal was the one that clinched it for you. What a goal as well, and the role that was played in that by Ryan O'Donoghue. Yeah, Ryan uh, worked worked hard today. You know, um, it's his third league game. Um, obviously, a very very talented player, but his hard work today was was really good and real good vision to to set up Kevin McLaughlin and, and Kevin finishes those goals nine times out of ten. So look, we're delighted. Um, you know, with ten or twelve minutes to go. Me, they were on top. They were ahead. The crowd were behind them. The wind was behind them. It, it, it was it was a daunting task. But I thought the way we stuck in there, and won a couple of crucial breaks, showed, showed real character. And, and I'm delighted how the guys stuck in. And look, we we, we pinched two points and uh, delighted, and we'll move on. Yeah, in these kind of conditions, it's a bit of a lottery, really, isn't it? I can be. There was a lot of turnover today, um, particularly you know for both teams, you know, go, playing into the breeze. You can see you had to bring it in that bit further, so that slows it down, and teams get people back. So there's a lot of bodies knocking around there, and the ball is is, is wet and slippy, so it can, anything can happen, you know. And you saw, you saw that um, with the return from from shooting today. But but look, it was it was always going to be a battle. Um, either very proud team, and, and and up here in their home patch, it's, it's going to be tough. So to get to get the two points and and and, and move on. We'll, we'll take it.